Oh, this about birds. I don't quite like about birds because birds leads to cats. Pigeons leads to cats. Cat among the pigeons. Next door's Tabby had a pigeon. Such flapping and couldn't kill it, wouldn't. Just played about, kept grabbing it again, and the bird was maimed. Someone had to. And pigeons like rats leads to cats. Rats, cats, rats, cats are filthy plague everywhere. Only how many feet from a rat? And pigeons are filthy. Rats are filthy. Cats are filthy. They're body poison. They bite you and the bite festers. But that's not it. That's not it. I know that's just an excuse to give a reason. I know I have no reason. I know it's just cats. Cats themselves are the horror. Because they're cats and I have to to get them out. I have to, mm, I have to make sure I never think about a cat because if I do, I have to make sure there's no cats. And I don't know if I checked properly. I can't remember. I was too frightened to notice. I have to go. Go around the windows again. I have to go around the windows again. Back to the kitchen. Back to the bedroom. Back to the kitchen. Back to the bedroom. Back to the kitchen. The bedroom. Back to the kitchen. Back to the door. The door might blow open. If it's windy. Even if it's not windy. Suppose the postman was putting a large packet and pushed the door and it came open because it wasn't properly shut. And then a cat, <clears throat> because they could get through very, very small. And once they're in, they could be anywhere. they're in, they could be anywhere. They could be under the bed, in the wardrobe, up on the top shelf, with the window sweaters. That would be a place for a cat to sleep. Or in a waste paper basket, or under the cushions, on the sofa, or in the cupboard with the saucepans, or in the cupboard with the food. A cat could crawl up on the cans of tomatoes. A cat could be in with the jam and honey. A cat could be in the biscuit tin. A cat could be in the fridge, in the freezer, in the salad drawer, in this box of cheese, in the broom cupboard, the mop bucket. A cat could be in the oven, the top oven, 
under the lid of the casserole, in a box of matches behind a picture, under a rug, to the bedroom, a cat could be under the bed, in the duvet, in the pillowcase, in the wardrobe, a cat could be in a shoe, or in a hanger, under my dress, in a woolly hat inside a coat, sleeve, a cat could be in any of the drawers, so I tip them all out and shake every cat could be behind books on the shelf, behind the DVDs. A cat could be in the teapot with keys. A cat could be on the ceiling. A cat could be on top of the doors. A cat could be behind me. A cat could be under my hand when I put out my hand. I need someone to say, there's no cats. I need to say to someone, do you smell cats? I need to say, do you think there's any way a cat have got in? And they have to say, of course not. They have to say, of course not. I have to believe them. It has to be someone I believe. I have to believe they're not just saying it. I have to believe there are no cats. I have to believe. There are no cats. And then...